Uh, so, so what's the sign you're carrying? It's basically something I've got given for free to kind of say that above three degrees it's a climate emergency. They were handing them out at yeah. the Eiffel Tower when we formed the human chain yesterday. Yeah, but there's a state of emergency uh, in Paris and Belgium, isn't there? Yeah, um, basically what happened when I went back to the Colonel Fabian, which is near the Generator Hostel where I'm staying, I got frisked by the police. Cool. Which was interesting and had my bag searched, yeah. the coat that I'm wearing searched and all my pocket searched for weapons, guns, bombs, everything. It's quite a like, Do they search your bags? Yes. Yeah. Um, that's, a, that's a tactical response to terrorists. Search your bags, search your bags, search your bags. Yeah, I mean like everything means um, even when we're back at the Eiffel Tower we're going to form the human chain, the gendarme, yeah. I think they're called, they were like checking people's bags to go in yeah. and it was just Kind of yeah, crazy. <laughs> and I hear like. some regions like Calais, the National Front, are going to probably win tomorrow. So here in Paris, we've made an alliance with the left. Do you think? Do you think we'll do well? I hope so. I mean, one thing I've noticed straight away from being in Paris is the amount of Front National posters everywhere. It's like pictures yeah. of uh, Marine Le Pen. I saw a poster that said "Take back your neighbourhood." Yeah, there was quite a few of them, like around the 20th or on D spot, so towards Belleville. A lot of take back your neighbourhood and trying to get Parisians yeah. to really stand up against Front National. And the 19th district as well. Yeah, I mean, that's where I'm staying, so it's, yeah, it's quite scary. Uh, <laughs> so, yeah, yeah uh, but, um, there's been a lot of graffiti here, so anyway. Yeah. Uh, cool. Right. Um, yeah, uh, good